So, so we have this blood coming from uh, from Emily on that side. So the blood's being drawn from her, and all the blood is going to all of this tubing. So her blood is being drawn out of her body and into this machine. So this tubing is all just kind of processing everything. So down here is the centrifuge, so there's a belt that's spinning it. So her blood's coming into this machine and it's being spun out so that we can separate it out and collect the stem cells. Eventually this will start to fill up with, it almost looks like blood, but a little bit lighter. And that's where the stem cells will be collected into this closed system bag. And then as, as the blood is going through her, it's separating it out, it will collect the stem cells and then it, this tubing is continuing. This is a blood warmer so that Emily doesn't get chilled. And then the blood is going back to her through the second IV in this one. And the other bags? So the other there. bags are, uh, one of them is just saline. So we're just giving her fluids through this process. And one of them is uh, calcium because the, the anticoagulant that we're using will attach itself to calcium in her bloodstream and drop her calcium level. So we're giving her some calcium. And then the third one is what we call ACD. It's, basically, it's an anticoagulant. It's keeping all this blood from sticking to all this tubing. So, and that's what's causing the calcium to drop. So we're giving her calcium to make up for that. So that's what these, these bags all are going on.